so as the year 2023 comes to an end and we go into the new year of 2024 there's a lot of things i would like to talk about before we of course get into conclusion with the new year um finally it was just uploaded yesterday as of this video uh tekken dynasty episode 9.5 and episode 10 are going to be three parters which is why episode 9.5 part one a prime awakening is part one of three episodes then after that it's tekken dynasty episode 10 part one part two part three finale like it's all it's it's all a combination a trilogy of episodes that will lead to the season one finale um i'm gonna be honest I had a lot of shit that made me want to quit this thing and cancel it all together. And it's not because I didn't want to do it anymore, the animation wasn't all that consuming to me, but a lot of things have happened to me this year, a lot of drama with people, and, and last year too because when I started animating this episode, when it was just Tekken Dynasty 9.5, um, this was 2022, by the way. So this is this episode came out a year after like I started animating it. Um, there was a lot of issues and people, you know, coming in or out of my life and crap that was just not going the right way for me my life was just not heading in the right direction at the time so as all, all this was going on as i'm animating this and putting it all together a part of me was just like uh, worn out and from all the mental stuff i was dealing with actors leaving the project stuff like that and it all just came to me and i was like fuck do I really want to keep doing this? Like, is it really worth putting all my time into this? Well, a lot of people told me as I was about to give up, especially when I lost the original fight scene uh, files for Heihachi and Lando. Like, I was told by many of my close friends not to give up. This is something you love. This is something you're passionate for. Why give up now? when you're so far ahead and all this stuff and it made a lot of sense to me and it really helped lift in my spirits and I just needed a lot of time to myself to take a break from it as well because yes I was worn out from animating it so when I came back um, I I did what I could to make sure that because the episode when I came back to it a couple of days ago, when I started animating it again, um, it was the, the runtime was nine minutes and thirty seconds, and I was talking to friends of mine in the group chat that we're in, and I was like, "This is too long. Like, this is already too long for a full length episode. Like, the script is like is not gonna fit into one episode." Which is why I made the suggestion of having it be a three-parter. Because technically, episodes 9.5 and 10 are the finale. But, in order for it all to come together, it needed to be a three-parter. Because that it cannot fit all of that that is in the script into one episode. That is just not possible. Might as well make episode 9.5 the finale if that was the case. Like, it's just, that would probably put me at like 20 or 30 minutes tops. Like, that is death for my fingers and for my mental state. So, yeah, um, when I got back to animating Second Dynasty episode 9.5 part 1, as it's called now, um, I was a lot more refreshed, I was a lot more energized, I was ready to put all my work into it when I got back you know put my hand back on the mouse and getting back to work and I went to look at the reception of Tekken Dynasty episode 9 and while everyone was talking to me and helping me and motivating me 
seeing how many people love this series and hearing how many people love this series, it, it, it drives me and motivates me to continue it. Um, like my, when it, whether it be closest friends, whether it be, you know, just general subscribers of the channel, or random people saying that, you know, they know Tekken Dynasty, they like Tekken Dynasty. Like, it's, it's refreshing, it's really nice to hear that. And that's what continues to keep me motivated and energized to keep doing this. It's people like you guys, I know, I know it sounds, you know, very generic but I'm not, I'm not sugarcoating it. it it's the truth you guys are my source of motivation and energy when it comes to completing this shit it's the same way I feel with the Kazuya channel like I could quit at any time and nobody would care but there also would be people who do care that come here you know to my channel expecting content wanting content wanting to be entertained wanting to laugh you know want to enjoy what they're seeing when I upload. That's the kind of shit that keeps me going. Um, God, Autumn killed it with Kazumi. Tyler and Charles absolutely crushed their roles as Lando and Heihachi here. Just as much as they did in the last episode and listening to all of their lines <laughs> currently. Um, man, you guys are in for a wild ride. So I hope you guys are prepared for the future of Tekken Dynasty. You know, 9.5 part 2, part 3, then we're gonna get the 10, part 1, part 2, part 3. And for now, it's season 1. I hope you're all ready for that. All the ideas that are gonna be thrown into the series. We got a lot of big things coming, so please stay tuned for that. Tekken 8 comes out in a couple of weeks from now, and I, I can't believe we're actually here. It feels just like yesterday when I saw the trailer. Um, and... To, uh, to be here right now um, talking about it just makes me feel a little emotional, I'm not going to lie. Because I started this channel during Tekken 7's release, and now that we're here for Tekken 8, it makes me think of how far we've came, you know, how far the channel has grown since then. And I can't wait to experience this game with you all for years to come. Uh, that's enough of my rambling. Uh, maybe the Shaheen reaction trailer from Kazuya will come soon, I don't know. But I think that's all up to Kazuya. What, what do you think? I have better things to do. I don't have a care in the world for what these people want. All I care about is domination! <laughs> well, there you go. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Share it around with your friends, you know, who are fan fans of Tekken. Um, and... Of course, see you in 2024. I will be live streaming Tekken 8 on the day of release, so please look forward to that on the YouTubes. That's all for me. Do the hell!